praise the almighty God, my good friend, uh, wherever you are, let us believe and pray. Therefore, I want to share the word of God shortly with you in Jesus' mighty name. Father, thank you for this moment. As I'm going to share the word of God with your people, Lord, may you use me as a vessel towards their life. In the mighty name of Jesus, I pray and believe. Amen. My good friend, listen to this. I want you to go straight to the book of um, James chapter number 4, verse 7. The Bible says this way, Submit yourself then to God. Resist the devil and he will flee from you. Praise the name of Jesus. I want to dwell on two things here. Submit yourself unto the Lord and uh, the next one is, and he will flee from you. Praise the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. It is good to submit yourself to the Lord. It is good to listen to the Lord. It is good not only uh, you submit yourself to the Lord when you have trouble, but it is good to submit yourself every season to the Lord. Praise the name of Jesus. And do you believe that the devil will flee out from you without any doubt? If you trust God, then the devil will flee out from where you are because you have already submitted yourself to Christ. One of the best things in this life is to submit yourself to the kingdom of heaven. When you submit yourself to God, he will reward you. He will open ways. He will protect you. He will, he will do everything it takes for you to, to, to be closer to him. The Bible says very clear here, and it says resist the devil. And how do we resist the devil? We resist the devil by obeying his word, by going down to him, by listening more to God by uh, 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 following the instruction of God, uh, the Ten Commandments. You, when you follow the Ten Commandments, you have already uh, obeyed God. Uh, you have already uh, taken yourself to the higher level of being with God, uh, of sticking to God himself because God uh, he is with you. Submit yourself to God. When you submit yourself to God, uh, no weapon shall form against you, uh, shall prosper because you are ready. You are in Christ. Over Ready, you are in him. Father, thank you for that person who have listened and to the word. And now, Lord, I pray, bless their hand, bless their life. Let them submit unto you in Jesus' mighty name. I pray. Amen. Amen. You are there, not born again. I want you to repeat this word after me. Father, I come before you. I am a sinner. I've sinned against you. Lord, write my name in the book of life. Remove my name today in the book of darkness. Write my name in that book of heaven. Thank you, Jehovah, for your salvation. Today, I want to follow you. I want to stick to you. Lord, guide me in Jesus' mighty name. Father, thank you for that person who are prayed. Lord, stand with them. Lord, guide them in Jesus' mighty name. I pray. Amen. Let again, I say, submit yourself to the Lord and obey his word. Praise the name of Jesus. The Bible says here, and as, as I finish with this, he said, uh, he will flee. The, the devil, the devil and he will flee from you. Atatoroka mahali ulipo. Once you obey the word of God, the devil will flee. He will, will not even be closer to you because you obey the Lord. Shalom. Peace of God be upon you. Who you, you have already received Christ. The devil has gotten out of your mind and now he, is, he has gone. He's far away. Now, where you are, you are a walking, walking Christian, Christian celebrated by many. Today, I celebrate you because you have already received Christ in your life. In Jesus' name, shalom, shalom, peace of God be upon you wherever you are. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray and say Amen, amen, shalom, shalom, peace be with you.